Hello, forum members, YouTubers, subscribers, everyone. Um, Zach here to do a uh, relatively brief review um, on a juice. Uh, about a week and a half ago, I got my first order from Ms. T, and I got 14 juices from her. And um, I promised myself that I would review most of them, if not all of them, um, either here or on my blog. Um, so, uh, if you've read my blog, you probably haven't. I'll put a link in the description, as always. Um, the first one I did was for MJ Brownies, um, which I am a big fan of. Really good. Um, and today, I'm doing a short review um, on Ms. T's uh, Lemonade. Um, I also got Pomegranate Lemonade and Strawberry, uh, no, Raspberry Lemonade. Um, big lemonade fan, um, big fan of fruit vapes, uh, so I figured what could be bad. Um, I'm just going to cut straight to the chase. Um, you know, the first thing I do when I get a new juice is um, take a good uh, whiff of it. Um, and, and the smell of a juice is definitely not um, always indicative of how it tastes, but, um, you know, I, 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 I try to give it a good um, you know, a good smell or two, just to get an idea, um, and some juices smell really great, and some juices really don't, I mean, and some of the ones that smell great vape awfully, and some of the ones that, uh, don't smell so hot, um, work great, but, uh, all that said, you know, this juice has a, <laughs> you know, it's kind of an interesting, um, smell, I mean, and and interesting. I mean, how interesting can it be? It's lemonade. Um, but by that I mean it simultaneously smells like really fresh uh, lemon juice with a bit of a lemon pledge uh, bite to it. I mean, I know that sounds completely contradictory, and it is a little bit, but um, it, it does smell nice, and yet with a little bit of... Um, house cleaner, uh, to it. But, you know, we're not really tasting, or we're not talking about, um, the smell, that's just, that's just the first impression I gathered, uh, from it, you know, when I, um, when I first, uh, used it. Um, and I haven't gotten to all the juices yet. Some of the videos I do may be, um, the first time I'm vaping them. This one I've used a little bit, um, and I've used a lot of the pomegranate, and I've used a lot of the raspberry. I've used up most of the six milliliters of the raspberry um, lemonade. Um, but, you know, so that, that's what I have to say about the smell, which, again, not necessarily indicative um, of how it vapes. Um, I'm just going to show you how it performs really quick. Uh, Miss T doesn't allow for, uh, she, she doesn't allow PG VG tweaking. So I'm not sure of um, the balance. It's a pretty thin juice, and as you can see, uh, is about the color of lemonade. Um, not a dark juice at all, and and yeah, pretty um, relatively thin. So it either has, I would guess, a lower VG content, or there's a lot of thinner. Either way, um, thin juice. Uh, I'm vaping this on a standard resistance uh, Joy 510 at 4 volts, um, and, and this atomizer is, is reading in between um, 2.1 and 2.3 ohms, depending on how long I let it sit. Um, so it's it's pretty cool right now. Um, but let me let me take a quick. So, uh, you know, a pretty nice amount of vapor. Um, I, I don't know what I'm, what I should be expecting from it, um, in the sense that, you know, some other websites, uh, you know, I, um, I tend to vape, um, 70% PG, uh, 30% VG. So, um, I, I would say that my impression of the performance is, is around that. Um, I'm, again, I'm guessing it's, it's a blend. Um, so it's a nice amount of vapor and, um, despite the slightly chemical, 
uh, smell, um, this has one of the truest uh, tastes of, of any juice I've ever had, I've really got to say. It's, um, you know, the flavor on the inhale is pretty mild, um, and, you know, it doesn't, it doesn't scream lemon right away, um, but on the exhale, it's really, um, it's got a really fresh taste, um, it's a really, really clean, um, lemon flavor, um, and honestly, I don't, I don't know what I can say that's bad about, well, you know, there, there's always, there's always good, bad, and uglies, um, so, but, but I'm taste alone, um, you know, on this atomizer, <laughs> at four volts, um, it, it's great, and I've used it on some low resistance atomizers, um, and it works well too. I guess, uh, the only, uh, the only time it doesn't really hold up is, um, at higher voltages, which is not that surprising, because I, I don't really like vaping, um, fruit, uh, juices at higher voltages anyway, um, and you might, uh, which is fine, um, but I found around 4.5, 4.6 volts, um, it started to, it just started to not taste as good, um, you know, and because it was getting so hot, it's kind of counterintuitive to, to lemonade, I mean, when I think of lemonade, I think of a nice, tall glass, you know, filled with ice, um, so I would, I would say for me anyway, um, that this is a, a cooler, or, or, you know, a juice that's best for cooler, uh, vapes. Um, I just want to show you the vapor production one more time. So it's working, um... It's working really well at this current setup, um, and again, it performs uh, really well in the low resistance atomizers at around 3.7, um, and and right up to about 4.5 volts. You know, if you do have a variable voltage um, device, uh, I have not tried it um, with a real high voltage atomizer yet um, at a higher uh, voltage setting, so I can't really speak about that, but. Um, so far, again, what I've gathered is it's probably better to slightly cooler vape. Um, if you are a menthol fan, uh, it has been really nice um, to, uh, you know, I, I took a, a three milliliter bottle and I, I put in about ten drops of this and like one drop um, of a pure menthol liquid that I have from Gourmet Vapor and um, mixes really well, unsurprisingly, um, you know, the lemonade flavor. Mixes really well with menthol. It's like having a nice iced lemonade. Um, I, I, you know, I guess that's all I have to say. Well, all. I, you know, rambled on for nine minutes, but it's a really good juice. I mean, and if you are a fan of fruit vapes, if you're a fan of lemonade, if you're a fan of citrus, um, I would absolutely, um, get a six milliliter bottle of this, um, because again, it's, you know, it's really, uh, dead on, and I've tried a lot of citrus, uh, citrus vapes, um, I'm, I'm a pretty big fan of gourmet vapors, Mosa, um, but a lot of them just taste so artificial, you know, and it's not even, and it's hard to put my finger on, but but they all just have that very, you know, again, artificial edge to them. And this one is nice and pure, nice and clean, um, not overwhelming by any stretch of the imagination, but still very flavorful. Um, you know, the only other downside is the throat hit is a little, a little weak, um, no matter what, uh, no matter what setup I tried it with. Um, but you saw the vapor, um, for me, I think it's a, an outstanding flavor, um, and, you know, yeah, she's, she's great. I mean, I'm, I'm a, uh, new fan of Misty, like everyone else, um, who has used her juice, but I'll put a link in the description, go check it out, um, put a link to my blog in the description, you can look at the MJ Browning review if you want, um, another one I was a big fan of, 
Um, and yeah, that's that. Uh, thanks for watching. I'll be back soon. Um, and I'll see you then. Bye.